Hey, this is Dan and Bob from Gigaboots.com, and welcome to our N64 celebration episode of We Play Your Mega Maker Levels. I figured since, you know, in 64, like the N64, we would do this episode in 240p. You know, YouTube allows uploading in 240p, and Mega Man is a 240p game, so I figured for the most authentic image, oh, no. we should upload at its intended resolution. I'm sure this, this will look great. This. <laughs> This level's titled, Need to Bless the Rains by Drop the Forte. Okay. See, it's like, Drop the Bass. Yes, I get that. Forte, it which is the, the name rains, of... Like, uh, which is like... Like, God bless, bless the rain. Sure, but, uh, <laughs> uh, but it's like, Bass's pet. Where's... <laughs> Where's he gonna end up? Oh, God, another one of these? Isn't Forte... Do, do people not know? Isn't Forte just Bass's Japanese name? No, that's Blues. No? Yes. His name is Blues. You want to put money on this? No, Blues is Proto Man. Oh, wait, wait. Who did you just say? Bass. No, Bass is Bass's name. Isn't oh, it? Because it's Mega Man Forte. Rockman Rock Forte. Forte. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. I was like, oh, hey, it's hey, Trevel is his, his... Dude, I think I have to take the hit there. Oh, man. You think that way, that's what he wants? Because yeah, how else? You don't have any other weapons it could be? No. It's fa Like, I just paused it. It was okay. Pharaoh Man's thing. That doesn't help me get up there, so I have to... Yeah, man. What the shit? I don't know. Of course, I don't have enough time to, like, <laughs> shoot a Pharaoh shot right there. <laughs> if it somehow killed him in one shot, that'd be hilarious. Well... Oh! Oh, my God. I couldn't Man, see that at that, all. That is well hidden. So I don't think I'm supposed to keep shooting. Probably not. I think do it. every every time I do this, people are like, "You cheesed my level," and I'm like, "You don't know your robot masters." Look, Whatever. this is it. awful. Like the thought of, "Oh man, you should just constantly be taking damage." Yeah, no, a lot of like, people love that idea. Like, We're not one of them. <laughs> We're not even two of them. Oh my god. Gotta be mashing the- Whoa! Ah! He's so Fucking fast! Fucking Goku over here! <laughs> okay. Maybe I'm alright with how this uh, video is getting uploaded now. <laughs> right? <laughs> Some of us deserve it, you know? <laughs> they deserve the peak of YouTube quality. <laughs> Remember you guys- Right. So, as you're watching this video, I want you to think about every dumb asshole who asks me, Why you upload in 4K? <laughs> and I want you to think of that anytime you hear sentiments like that ever again, okay, audience? Okay. <laughs> if it's not 4K, it's this. You don't like this. Nobody no, does. No, no. <laughs> Look, asshole. You're gonna sit here and not understand quality. I will make you pay for that stance. <laughs> You know so the you know the best get out part. This time. Oh my god. I guess he really wasn't supposed to get out. Yeah. That's a shame because maybe Pharaoh Shot would have killed him. Right? Maybe. I doubt it. There's there's a lot of questionable decisions being made here. He's just up there hopping up and down right now. Just right. He'll visualize which it, it. Eventually he'll get out because you make him hop so much. Oh, you think that's it? Maybe. That'd be hilarious if that was it. <laughs> Darn it. <laughs> not quite. Not, not, no. You know, Bob, I, I feel like you should take this level on the next life if, yeah. I, if I don't make it, because I know how much you love levels like this. Oh yeah, everyone loves these. So... Damn it, I hit jump! <sighs> yeah... Not a, not a, not a fan. Alright. Yeah. This is... <sighs> they should have named him Fortissimo. <laughs> no? Yeah. Why not? Sure, why not? Yeah, it'd exactly. be great. It'd be great. Because it's way better than Forte as a name. Because Forte could be anything. It could even mean something he's really good at. And as we know, Bass is good at nothing. <laughs> I don't know. He's... Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Seems to be Big Man up in that intro to Big Man 8. No. Oh, you can jump on that thing in the middle. Oh my god! <laughs> that needs to stop happening. 
But yeah, no, he got he got stuck in cables. He did. So only fair man power. <laughs> this person did not know. How did the, that he was able to escape that? I don't get it. Like, what did? He, yeah, I don't think that was glitch. the end of the level. I imagine oh, I was supposed man. to keep going. Oh, you're Instead right. Instead, he appeared there. Oh, well, it's not our fault that that level was not designed right. You know? It relied yeah. on a very unreliable thing. Yes. <sighs> hey, Bob. Hey. I feel like you're down about that. Uh, okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. This level is fuck, 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 fuck. Hey, Coon. I'm sure this will be great. <laughs> Bob, you know what I love? What's that? I love how much red your time this episode saving me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it'll be like, what, 10 minutes? <laughs> Please! Minutes? <laughs> huh. No weapons. Yeah, no, also make this episode super short. <laughs> well, I'm just, you know, I'm used to rendering in 4K, which takes about real time. Right. Actually, uh, almost double real time. Um, <sighs> hey, Bob, we're really lucking out today. Yeah, this these levels that just want you to take damage. You know that's what? It. I'm, just, I'm just gonna say it because I know it'll piss off Asidia. This is a lot like an Asidia level. <laughs> I died. It's like an Asidia level. Oh man, is it also like Dark Souls? It is. Okay. I didn't. I, right, yeah. I mean, Asidia always makes those Dark Souls inspired stages, you know? It's you, just so you can Dark tell. Souls like. <laughs> so if I don't perfectly slide through every single one of these, it'll be a cascade of pain. Unless I slow the fuck down, like that. So at least there's some rhyme or reason once you understand the layout. Right. You can... <laughs> what? What? Why is it going again? There's so many layers. <laughs> there are so many layers. <laughs> that was an amazing ending. I yeah. don't think it was voluntary at all. I'm, I'm, I'm voting it. <laughs> there's no way you could... How could you... I don't know how you could intentionally or unintentionally cause that. Yeah. I mean, there are conveyor belts down there to feed him in <laughs> under the water. Right. Oh, that was that was good. That was good. Very Asidia. Very Asidia. 100 plays. Jeez. That guy gets around. Yeah, he does. He's into that brand management. That guy gets around. You make him sound like a whore. <laughs> Look at that. Capvolution slumming up on Twitter. <laughs> Can't believe he tagged those people. <laughs> this is Cold Village by Cap Blue. Hundred plays. Yeah, hundred it's, plays. It's a lot. It is a lot. Especially in Mega Maker Town, where <sighs> where four is the order of the day. Right. Yeah. Oh man, <laughs> I I actually didn't bring this up in a uh, previous video. I I should have, but I'll br I'll bring it up now. Uh, what was the Captain Pollution tweeted at me sometime recently? Cause like, we like his levels. Uh, it just never seems to draw him, right? Right. Um, he tweeted at me recently, he's like, I'll have you know I'm the only live streeter, streamer to beat my new level, and I'm like, I was tempted to reply, I'm the only live streamer to fuck my wife! <laughs> like, wow, impressive. <laughs> also depressing that you think about every live streamer as a challenger to the throne. <laughs> Did something happen? <laughs> yes. But I kept that guy off live streams and Twitter. <laughs> <That's our Twitch. laughs> that guy on Facebook, though, he totally fucked my wife. <laughs> <laughs> you know... But they don't let you live stream for Facebook yet, so I'm, I'm safe. It is pretty funny that we never draw, you know, Captain Pollution, but the episode we uploaded to 40p sure did draw him. Oh man, I, that is sad. <laughs> I, I kept, I kept finding him kind of funny. <laughs> I crushed him, now. I crushed him with the block. Yes. So far, I like this level. It is. It does have slip sliding, but it doesn't seem as bad as it. You're right, because be. that doesn't seem to be the core difficulty of it. Right. So uh, things for you to note, Bob, because I'm not sure you're aware. What's up? Not only will this be 240p, but because of the necessity of it, it will be 30 frames per second, and our audio will be garbage. Oh no! I didn't <laughs> realize it also be 30 frames per second. That's awful. It's very authentic. It's very N64. <laughs> 
30? That sound, doesn't sound like 16 to me. And that's true. <laughs> Look, we're talking about Mario 64 and nothing else, which is a pretty good, pretty good way to talk about the N64. Let's be real here. <laughs> The N64 was a great console. Uh, it didn't have very many good games. Uh, no, I'm talking like... Like Mario 64 was a good game. Ah. True. Okay. <laughs> I'm just saying! That's how it seems to go online sometimes. Sometimes. Okay. Yeah, I know, I... I always have... A hard time thinking of a large library of good 64 games. I don't think that's a thing. Uh, I don't think it has a large library of good games. I think the games it has that are good are some of the best of that generation. Yeah, for sure. That's, and that's like the difference. You're weighing, like, you're weighing Ocarina of Time and Mario 64 against Symphony of the Night and, I don't know, Ark the Lad. That's a random grab. <laughs> I was like, geez, couldn't have you chosen a better one? I'm like, fine, Blaster Master, fuck you. <laughs> Damn, that released so late, it basically shouldn't be called that yet, even. <laughs> I know, it's great. <laughs> it's like, I'm, I'm here while the PS2's out. It's like, cool. Gross. <laughs> I'll take this for Final Fantasy VI, but I ain't taking it from you. <laughs> Sorry. Nine. Man, dyslexia is real. Right. So... <laughs> let's talk. Sometimes you just really want Napalm Man to die. I feel like... I mean, that's always. <laughs> so it gives you a reflector, think, lets you I get think, the job done. I think it was in the Giga Quotes thing. It's like, hi, I'm Napalm Man, we know. <laughs> <laughs> I liked that level. It looked neat. It was a good level. I had fun. Um, I had fun in 240p. <laughs> this level's Elevator Action, a Flash Stopper Challenge by CCCP. Is it... Isn't CCP the people who make uh, EVE Online? No, I'm pretty sure it's actually the, the name for that community combined codec pack that's, that you can use to watch video and whatnot. I thought that was KKKP. <laughs> no. Hey, then, maybe, maybe I should play. Yeah, okay, fine. All right. <laughs> I got everything I wanted out of this level. Oh, I don't have slide. Uh-oh. And I also kind of, well, you know, oh, okay. you, you could have survived that. Wee 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 Alright, I can't slide out of that. <laughs> it's fine. Wee 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 well, actually, it's 240p, 30 hertz, so maybe not. Because, <laughs> you know, it'll just be pure white. Right. <laughs> I didn't even think of that. Oh, man. Yeah, I no, you were supposed to... Yep. Huh. I figured you were supposed to be writing them down, but it seemed to be okay for right, a bit Right, it there. was like, I don't really need that, though. Man, sliding. That would be too nice. Right? Do you... Oh god, I left the screen so it's not gonna actually play spawn. Yep. Bob will give you the satisfaction. <laughs> this just in, Bob from Gigaboots won't satisfy me. Man, this, uh, <laughs> this news guy is real weird. <laughs> uh, I feel like that's what happens if you cross yellow journalism and Kotaku. <laughs> <laughs> why why do you want to have sex with me <laughs> that's when the uh that's when the writer's like i really respect bobs i'm all for bobinism <laughs> oh no okay <laughs> oh boy Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. It's going so well. Somebody asked me why Crystalis was not on my top list. Let me tell you why. I haven't beaten that game. I've beaten every other game on that top list. Top games ever. <laughs> Maybe I should make one of those. 
Yeah, I, f I feel like maybe we should make videos out of it. I was mostly doing the whole experiment of asking coworkers and... Oh, yeah, that was uh, close. You should get moving. Yeah. What? You hit both, didn't oh, you? Yeah, I did. It's okay if you're... No, okay. This <laughs> is... <laughs> um, just to see if there are any games I've forgotten. Holy shit, no. No one's bringing up anything that I would put on mine. Everyone thinks I have these, quote, bad opinions, end quote, <laughs> because I'm some sort of hipster, but really, I just, I don't like any of the stuff you guys like. Oh my god. Do you want to try it, Dan? Oh, yeah, I'll, sure. Oh, you take it back over. I mean, I, I love spinning in place, like this. Yeah. There you go, that city level practice will have you here. <laughs> uh, yeah, we did it a city level. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Not this episode, you know what I mean. I mean, Toad Man there was pretty Asidia. <laughs> and so was Stone Man. <laughs> really, all these levels are very Asidian. You notice that? Totally. Cat Pollution is like, don't you dare fucking say my level's like Asidious. <laughs> nah, your level's like my wife. <laughs> oh, is it because we were talking about how his level got around? What? No. Okay. Wait, did you just imply... I'm, I'm just gonna let that one slide, Bob. Because we're good friends. <laughs> at least I thought we were. Damn it, I did uh, not time that right. Uh, okay. okay, at least that resets him. No, because he, he was like, I'm the only streamer to be my own level! <laughs> oh no, oh no. Uh, Fuck! This is, uh, crazy. Yeah. Whoa! The, um... <laughs> Magic! Damn it. You want to restart the level, but there's no checkpoint. Wah, 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 wah. Shit! <laughs> it really got away from me there. Yeah. These things move quick. <laughs> Aha! What do you think about that? Oh, you're... You're not impressed. No. No one is. Oh, no. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, my God. Ah! Close. Yeah, this is, uh... Tough business. Yeah, I gotta let yeah. the difference grow more there. Right. So I forgot to turn off that Odd Renew on PlayStation Plus, so I have another three months of that. Oh, fucking awesome. Yeah, so it's like, just what I want to spend $25 on, I sh This I sh goddamn sh scam! <laughs> You know, every day, that dumb joke we wrote in that pitch for a series for the escapist gets more and more true. <laughs> yeah. See, in this in this series we pitched for the escapist, Dr. Agro sealed Hale Zeon in his bedroom and charged him $50 to get out to play online with other players. Because, <laughs> you know, Agro, um, Agro's a violent man and has very strong Ideologies that must be respected. <laughs> it's really funny to know, think that yeah, they they do know who those people are in our current Gigaboots lore. Yeah, no, we can <laughs> that that whole crew, that whole cast translates. You know, fuck it, <laughs> right? I'm not doing the whole level over for the hope that in E tank. Yeah, I was like, wait, no, no, no. But yeah, no, the whole thing translates, right? They know Eric, they know Brett, they know Agro, they know Hail Zeon. It's like... The only person who doesn't show up is Firehawk? <laughs> Which, man, wouldn't that be hilarious? Right. Hi, I'm Firehawk, and I know you from the future. <laughs> okay! Oh, man, this is messed up. Ah, oh, it's gone. It's gone. Uh, you killed it. Ah, uh, ah! Uh. And they come back. No! Time to die. <laughs> I won't give them the satisfaction.
satisfaction. I'm not gonna satisfy you, Kotaku Rider. You hear me, Tim Rogers? Tim Rogers writes, I didn't really want sex with Dan video games, but once he told ah, me I couldn't have it, I was really mad. God. <laughs> That's too insane! You know- We're almost there! Right? I know! That's why it's the worst, you know? Admittedly, I don't think Tim Rogers has ever written anything like that. <laughs> it's more about Kotaku writers in general. <laughs> Oof. Woof. <laughs> bark. <laughs> it will be like, right bark. Oh no. Oh, no. Bounced. Maybe you just won't need it. Yeah, I'm sure. That's... I won't need any of these. You won't need any of them. It's fine. <laughs> oh my god, that's sick. <laughs> <laughs> it was so impossible to make that jump across, but I started <laughs> trying. Yes. Good on you, Dan. This is a really interesting way to use- Ah, oh, but- Yeah, they're so- You have to be so delicate with it. Yeah, I like these challenges. This- This level's pretty interesting. I like it when novel challenges show up. Right. Like that time a city of made us use Windstorm. You know the one. The one level where he did that. That one a city level? Come like on, Bob. That was a lot more than one a city level. No, that was one. Ooh, boy. Oh, man. Oh, no, I can't get across because of this fucking thing. Yeah. Eh. Eh. Oh, you need to be under you still. Oh, no! Because you can't slide. That's rough. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, this is, this is really difficult. Right? As it turns out. Uh, Damn it, fucking shit cock! Damn ass! Hey, Bob. Hey, how's it going? You know, I'm not playing this level, so... Not that bad. Okay. We should play more Cuphead. Hell yeah, we should. And maybe some other things. No. No? Nothing no. else? Look, Bob. Like what, Sonic what? Mania or something? Who? You know... That yeah, I, you know, I guess. I guess we could finish where the stream left off. Somebody did ask us to do that, and I'm all for more Sonic Mania. More Blue Sphere. No. Well, that's all there is in Sonic Mania, so... Oh, my God. <sighs> no! This is excruciating. Yeah. I promise I'm not going to do an Orson Welles impersonation <laughs> or bring up the Super NT. It's too late, Dan. Now you said Super NT. We have to talk about it. I didn't it. bring it. <laughs> so the Super NT... <laughs> Bob's right. Oh, no. <laughs> what? Oh, no. Why? One moment. I'm gonna go fuck myself. <laughs> uh, You know, it's been days. And still... I feel like we should probably make a video about the Super NT. Yeah. Because I, I look at the videos that are out there, and they're, they're maybe not the best. Oh, fucking really? Oh, fuck. Yeah, that's Yeah, no, I can't do that. Because you, you, you brought it up in the other one. You huh. brought it up in the other episode, just how that guy kept saying FPGA and clearly had no idea what that meant. It's like it has 16 megs of power. Ah, oh, they're gone, Dan. They're gone. No, no, it's them. fine. It's fine. I'm just clearing out this area. <laughs> I'm gonna do this. Then we're gonna go right back down, and they'll be there. Ugh. <laughs> it's fucking shadow gate in here. Right. Took one step too far. One step closer to the edge. Oh, did you did you stab him with the spear? Cause he has that spear now, and he's pissed. <laughs> oh, well, that's that's bad. Uh, no. Okay. God. Go. 
god. So delicate. It's a lot to clear out. Oh, oh my, my god. god! No! What? Ah! Ah! <laughs> Bob is face palming so hard. <laughs> It's like he's just doing this because he's always goes loose. Oh no, why is Dad reacting like that again? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, you. <laughs> Shut up, Muggsy. <laughs> By the way, people uh, quoted the whole a blind person ma <sighs> making fun of their own handicap thing. Uh huh. In reference to Cutman. I didn't remember cracking that joke about Cutman. But then Bob and I watched a, a clip reel from the Mega Man cartoon where Cutman's like, I'm gonna turn you into paper dolls! <laughs> and we both just laughed so hard, and I'm like, oh, Cutman. And then I remembered that's where that came from, and I was like, oh, right. Cutman's really sad. He's just depressing. I mean, I'd rather, I'd rather hear jokes from a blind man about being blind, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> At least gave you enough room to jump over that one. I, I really want to want- Oh, Dan! It's fine! <laughs> why, Dan, why? Fuck you! This isn't easy! I, I know! <laughs> Whoop. It's okay. Because through my immaculate platforming skills, I'm gonna... <laughs> <laughs> here you go, Bob. Sure. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Bob's like, oh, thank God, I have it now. We're done. Like, this is just one run and I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> that did not work right. Yes. It didn't work right. I hit the jump button on no, accident, okay? <laughs> How did that unfreeze time again? <laughs> things happen. <laughs> Bad things. Bob has one key bound to everything. <laughs> I thought it would save time. I tried to do it too fast. I like fidget spinners. Not too high. <laughs> God, it's still too high. <gasps> wow, Bob, this looks really hard. Almost like I shouldn't chide you for fucking something up because that would make me a total dick and then you'd hand me the controller. <laughs> I think the more interesting thing to have to account for in this level is the momentum of the startup of those platforms. Because they do ramp up in speed at the beginning. Like, I thought it would be, you touch them, they go. Mm -hmm. And that is uh, not the case. You need to touch that one before. Oh, okay. Well, no. Oh, God. I just started doing it. Stupid Here, stuff. Let, me, let me just finish this, because I got, sure. like, basically all the way there. And then somewhere around the fourth, Dad, why? I was like, well, whatever, fuck you, here's a controller. <laughs> yeah. This is the part that actually kept killing me. Right. Oh, it's gone. I have to do... Well, actually, that I don't need that block. I really just need to be able to get all the way back to the left, and this block appearing is what ruined the run. 
All right, because I need to shoot that up there, and that was it. That was the last block. All right. That was it. You can't get <laughs> back because you went too high. So, yep. So I dumb. Got, I got too high. Oh. Stupid entire mechanic at the level. You're dumb. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I'm starting to starting to wonder how much of this people can tolerate. Right. There are timestamps for a reason, ladies and gentlemen. Well, this is probably the last stage. It's a choose your own adventure. Hey, Bob, you don't you don't know. Yeah, this is gonna take like another like, twenty minutes what or something. Do you, what do you, what do you, it's no, probably our, we're probably our, probably our 30, probably it. thirty plus minutes. You know, I could really get this. You know, I could really get this if I had that E tank. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Say, so, hey, Bob. What's up? Um, did you know? Oh, no. Did that count? No! It's okay. I'll make it based on these first two. Yeah. I'm sure it's that'll possible. Work. Oh, man. I don't actually use the ladders he puts there. Oh, no. Oh, 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 no. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah! So Bob, what's up? Uh, the Famicom Disk System. Let's talk about it. Mm -hmm. There's a reason. Okay, sure. Okay. As you may or may not know or recall, uh, the bulk majority of NES classics you think of were actually initially designed for that. Legend of Zelda. Right. Metroid. Yeah. Kid Icarus. Zelda 2, even. Um, oh man, now this one's really far behind. Yeah. Um, but the problem is not only do the uh, floppies cost a lot. Well, actually, I don't. I don't know that for a fact. But they do have um, durability problems. Like, right. like they're floppies. They just lose the magnetism and uh, they're fucked. Right. Right. Well, as it turns out, the Famicom disk system is comprised of two things: the thing called the RAM adapter, which adds a little bit of working RAM and the uh, sound processor for the uh, Famicom disk system, because those games sound different on that. Right. Uh, and then the actual disk system itself. Those are two different parts. Did you know that? No. So, what somebody did is they made it so all you need is the RAM adapter part What am I doing? What's... How am I gonna do this? Uh, okay. Oh, no! Fuck! That thing is such a bait! Yeah. You know? It's like, oh, you gotta shoot me! Every time I think I have to shoot it from here. Yeah, no. Yeah. Um... So. Somebody made a thing where it's like a USB drive. You just hook it up to the RAM adapter, and it pretends to have... to be the disk system. Huh. It spools off the data at the speed the disk system would. It has the, uh, ROMs on it for the disks. Right. So you can have the entire Famicom disk system uh, collection for rather cheap. Like, really, really cheap. Because as it turns out, the uh, RAM adapters don't cost that much. Which is weird as hell to me, but what do I know? Is that... Can't the Analog NT just play all the disk system stuff without worrying about that or not? It can, but then it's it's simulating arguably poorly oh, okay. the sound of the, uh, the RAM adapter. Um... Because they didn't build a low-pass filter into the... The anti-mini. Mm-hmm. So... Oh, shit. No, I'm done. Okay. So, the, the sound isn't as soft and warm as it should be. It's a lot more computer-sounding. Huh. Yeah, like, sharp. Right. Audio files might describe it as cold. <laughs> huh. I did not realize that was a... Uh... Oh, yeah, no. Vinyls have a warm sound to them. Yeah, no, I, I know that. But I, I wasn't sure what to call a cold sound. <laughs> uh, iced tea, you'd probably call it cold. <laughs> oh, oh, no. It's fine. I don't... I don't care anymore. 
was the rest of that sentence. <laughs> One episode this week. I would like one episode to not end like this. Right? Just like, oh man. <laughs> one single mistake ruins everything. Uh, but yeah, the RAM adapter is only like 30 bucks. And that USB stick's only like 20. Huh. So for $50. Where does the RAM adapter go? Like, uh, it plugs into the cartridge port. Okay, and then the games would go into the separate. Yeah, they, they go port. into a cable that, it, like the USB thing. Yeah. Okay. That was risky. Yeah. Oh no, it's gone. <laughs> I don't even know if I need the middle one. I don't think I need the middle one, Bob. Okay. Go for it. We're Dan. gonna find out. The hard way. The hardest way. I'm starting to think I'd need it to cross the gap. Right. Because by the time I go up high enough to. to do it. Uh huh. All of these will be back. Oh. My. Now, compare that to the cost of Akamajo Densetsu. Castlevania 3. Right. How much is that? 50 bucks. Okay. So, you can get the entire Famicom Disk library for 50 bucks. Or you could get Castlevania 3, the Does... Japanese version with the good audio. Right. Does... It, it has a similar situation there. No, um, I'm just curious of if... This thing sounds, or like, are the good tracks, does it actually sound good on the disc system? Like, what's up? Do, does the music for the disc system actually sound good? It's a completely different sound. Okay. Um, I honestly think Zelda 2 sounds better from what I've heard online. Mm hmm. Um, and that's all that matters, okay, asshole? <laughs> oh, okay. Um, but yeah, it's just every game's different. Zelda, like, in, like, a large part of this, I'm not. Oh, ho, 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 ho. magic! Shit! 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 No. Double shit! Quadruple shit! <laughs> I don't think I'm ever beating this. The worst part is I know what I need to do. Right. <sighs> that sure is me and Mega Maker as of late. Yeah. But yeah, it's not tough enough anymore, I'm, Dan. I'm really not a nostalgia person, but there's something. There's definitely a weird disconnect you build in your brain when Zelda 2's title screen doesn't sound right. Yeah, like that's not what that fucking sounds like. You're not my childhood. <laughs> the hell is this? Right. I mean, I feel like there's some other situation like that was. There's a console where it's like, this is just... You made, like, CD-style music for this, and now it's awful. Um, are you perchance referring to the Master System, where it has the... <gasps> it's okay. Here's what we're gonna do. And then... It's not... Ah! It's like, it's not fast enough. It's not. Well, maybe this just need two. In theory, you know, I should be able to just perfectly time this one. Okay. Oh, jeez. <sighs> There's a checkpoint, There's a checkpoint in the, here, so that's my only, only priority. Darn it. <laughs> I thought I knew him well enough. <laughs> then I crushed myself. Yeah, I guess you could freeze it directly under it, so it could just be like, <laughs> Oh yeah, because it won't freeze him. Right. I forget these things. <laughs> it's not easy no. now, but it is easier. Whoa. Oh man, Mega Mega. <laughs> You're beautiful. <laughs> you beautiful bitch. But yeah, I'm kind of interested in that idea. This Just because it was $50 for the whole catalog. Any more than that, I feel like I'd be like, nah. That's all right. <laughs> right. Yeah, I don't know. It's... It's interesting. I'd like to hear some of that stuff, <laughs> sure. Um... My Life of Gaming has an audio comparison. Okay. They did. Um... Castlevania 3's, uh, Japanese cart probably sounds better than any of that stuff, but... It, it sounds... It sounds... 
You know I'm worried. I'm worried that I care so much about Castlevania that I'm gonna buy a fifty dollar copy of Jas Japanese Castlevania. <laughs> you know, what I was thinking of it was Mega Man X3, like re-released. Oh, on the PlayStation. The, the, oh no, that's a nightmare. It's yeah. not gonna end up like that. Right. Because there's so many layers with that. There's so many layers of problems. It's like. It's CD audio, which is weird. It loops terribly, which is awful. And then, like, the original SNES sound is so good. Right. It's like some of the best chiptune ever. <laughs> it's like he, repla he replaced the peak of chiptune music with this band. You know, you, you know them, but no one else does. They're really cool. <laughs> Your level was good. This visual audio internet transmission was brought to you by our Malflorious executive producers. Vincent Poverk, Nicholas Cameron, Peter Meekum, Ely Broyles, Unit Number 2, Joshua Mattingly, Shane Warden, and Cywolf, who's a good boy. And also these guys. Head on over to patreon.com slash gigaboots and become one of these names today.